two-minute warning. Good morning, Bleed Big Blue Nation. This is Marco, your host of the Bleed Big Blue podcast. And today I wanted to talk to you about smoke screens. I saw a tweet pop up in my feed. That tweet mentions that the Giants and Giants GM Dave Gettleman is very aware that there were leaks in the organization, that other teams knew who we were going to draft, and there were real no surprises, and this hurt us in a few cases. Under Jerry Reese, it seemed that the beat writers already knew who they were going to draft, even if they didn't interview them or work them out. In 2016's draft, it looked like the Giants were all on board with drafting linebacker Leonard Floyd. The Bears knew this, made a trade with Tampa Bay to move up two spots and grabs Floyd. The Giants had a scramble, and then they selected Eli Apple. These are the type of examples that Dave Gettleman wants to avoid. So they're going to put out a lot of misinformation, according to Giants beat writer Jordan Renan. So be mindful of what you're hearing. They're going to pass up on the quarterback. They're definitely going to grab Barkley. They'll probably throw out Chubb in there as well. They're going to throw out a lot of misinformation to throw the fans off, but most likely to throw other teams off and not let them know what we're going to do. I think it's a good move. I think it's a smart move. Keep other people on your toes and have your plans in place and have your crew tight-lipped. It only helps our case if other teams don't know what we're doing and it helps our draft value with that number two pick. So let me know what you think down in the comments below. Do you think that there already has been some misinformation just to confuse everyone? Also, if you are new here, please hit the subscribe button. Turn on notifications. This way you don't miss anything. If you need any information about the channel or the website, there are always links down below. And we'll talk to everyone tomorrow. Peace out.